quick primer on pronunciation, le moashi. And the key to pronoun pronouncing that word is to completely ignore the fact that there are two T's in it. <laughs> right? Just get rid of those T's. They don't exist. Mon raché. Boom. Mon raché is the most expensive land on planet Earth. If you want to buy land on Times Square, on the Ginza, on the Champs Elysees, it's it's pennies compared to the land in the Moashi. It is by far exponentially the most expensive land on planet Earth. It is a tiny vineyard. That vineyard is divided in two. Um, from a slow perspective, because you guys didn't give me a map. <laughs> Um, to understand the more the Moriche, you kind of have to pretend that Pierre knows what he's doing. The Moriche is kind of like that, right? This side being the Puligny Moriche side, this side being the Chassagne Moriche side. So what's the difference? This side's getting east sun. This guy's this side's getting southeast sun. Okay, southeast sun is better than east sun. The so the Chassagne side of the Moraché has always been considered the better side of the greatest white wine vineyard on earth, right? And therefore, it is allowed to be called le Moraché, the Moraché. As you saw on the label, we very proudly put le. There is a break in the hillside Right, immediately on the south side of Le Moraché, right? That break in the hillside has forever and a day been the road or the route to get through the hills and up to go north. And by north, I mean you're in Nice and you need to get to Paris, whether you were walking or on horseback or donkey back or, or, or car, that's how you got to Paris, was to go right by the Moraché. So everybody who's ever gone you know, prior to the, to the interstate, right, which is what, 30 years old, everybody who ever went north from the south of France went through and went right by the Moraché. So Napoleon went by it when, when he came back to France, etc. By law, now they've changed it, but for centuries, whenever the French military marched up that road, they had to stop, face the Moraché, stand at attention, and salute. Whoa. This is a serious vineyard, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> the, when they installed the interstate, when they came in to install the interstate, since that is the natural way to get through the hill, the plan was to take the interstate right, right through it. The problem is, interstates are wider than a normal road, and they would have had to take out part of the Moraché, and, and you know, and there were massive protests and demonstrations, <laughs> etc. So today, the highway does this zigzag to get up the hill through between Bone and savigny le bone If not, it was just a straight shot, right? Yeah. So this is a very, very serious super expensive um, jewel of a vineyard um, that is the tenderloin of the tenderloin. It is the absolute um, perfect place for Chardonnay. If you are just below the Moraché, you're in a vineyard called Batard Moraché, right? If you are just above the, the Moraché, you're in a vineyard called Chevalier Moraché. So what does Moraché mean? It means the bald hill. Why, what is a bald hill? It's a hill without trees <laughs> on the top. So the, the, as, you, as you walk out of Puligny, the village of Puligny, and you walk towards these great vineyards, the first one you come to is a, is a grand cru called Bienvenue Batard Moraché. 
welcome to the bastard of the bald hill. Mm -hmm. The next vineyard as you walk up is Bata Moache, the bastard of the bald hill. <laughs> then you have Le Moache, right? Is the bald hill. Oh, that's part of Bata, right? But that's on the Chassain side. That's on the on the south slope of the Batard. And since I'm walking from Pudini, I can't see the Priot. Yeah? I'm paying attention. <laughs> <laughs> and you walk past the, the Morache and you go into the Chevalier Morache. And I remember what I told you about limestone and clay. So Chevalier Morache is on the top, and it is linear, finesse, vibrancy, right? But that Morache, the bastard, is just below the the, the Moache. So it is richer, broader shouldered, it has chest to it, right? The Moache has both. That's the key. The Moache has it all. 